that artists could just, just hit it. Yeah. Um, but we have event pool, uh, Belgian artists, writers, and Dutch artists, and Dutch or Spanish artists, these foreigners visiting Paris and coming up. Artists were fascinated by prostitution from a number of points of view. They were male artists, they were fascinated by female sexuality. But to limit it to that would be to come up with far too simple an answer. Another reason is that modernity was moving forward at a very rapid speed at this time. Cities were growing. Cities were becoming places where people from all parts of the world, different countries, different parts of single countries met and mixed. People didn't know who they were. Hierarchies had disappeared. People often were slipped into unemployment and had nothing to back them up. So prostitution was flourishing. People were uncertain about identity. Ambiguity made questions get raised. Who's who? Will she, won't she? Is she, isn't she? topic, as it were, that we're in right now, where we're standing, is about the grand uh, courtesans. Um, those were independent women who had become extremely successful and highly regarded in society, and they became fashion icons and sort of celebrities, really, that one looked at. And what's interesting about his work is that he depicts things as he sees them, but also with compassion and um, in, a, in a sort of very human way. He doesn't glamorize the subject. Um, and he also um, shows, for example, scenes in the brothels that are of a very personal nature when the women are just waiting around or are waiting for a doctor's examination, sort of not this sort of glamorous aspects or what one might think of as glamorous aspects or very sexual aspects. Um, 